Hi Taurus, welcome back in. Taurus, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus and Jupiter. Let's see what's cooking for you. Taurus. Oh my God, Aquarius <laughs> just had the same card. Taurus, there is something which you feel is not for you, right? This is something I don't belong to. The situation is very tricky. There are mind games. I see the chessboard here, right? For a lot of you in your surroundings, there are people who are questioning you. Why, Taurus? Why do you think so? Why do you feel so? Why are you not comfortable? You know, there are questions. There are people who are just you know, amazed to see your reaction when you are not comfortable with something. For someone specific, I'm picking up that. And there is a situation which is possibly promising you something, right? It's a possible, like there's a potential. I'm not sure. I'm not saying that you're definitely going to get something big out of it. But yes, there is a potential. There is an offer. There is a possibly a promise associated like you know it, even if it's not a promise this is a situation i'm picking up that um for example if you work this way you're going to get promotion or if you do something uh, you're going to get reward for it right some good reward for it people are just looking at the reward people are just looking at the destination and they're asking you questions why do you why do you think so you know why are you not willing to work over it or why are you so confused about it what people don't know is that you have to go through some dirty game or some tricky game to be there which i think you feel is not for you right i see you are like uh, this is like a small potato bag um in the middle of the chess board people are shrewd people are playing games and uh, you can be dirty if you want if you if you you know if you just try to be that way but you don't want to that thing that place that situation is not for you right you're not like that well i'm picking up some kind of energy where your closed ones are like your closed ones are uh, questioning why don't you want this thing why don't you want why don't you feel comfortable here right but I think you have some deeper feelings. You have some deeper understanding of something which other people don't. Moving in your reading, I'm oh, sorry, moving into your reading, Taurus. Let's see what is the situation. Eight of Cups, see? You feel you don't belong to this place. You don't belong to the situation. You want emotional departure. For some of you, Eight of Pentacles reversed is making me feel that you know i just can't work over it i cannot focus i cannot concentrate i just cannot be here eight of cups is like uh, moving away from something for some time in order to have better introspection better clarity right uh, instead of just listening to the people listen to yourself listen to your heart hmm. in your surroundings i see oh baby for a lot of you, I see the question is coming from a place where um, somebody is in love with you. Somebody feels that see how these two hands are, see how these two hands are hand in hand, right? Yeah, ten of coins in reverse. For someone specific, I'm picking up um, this lack of commitment to do something. Ten of pentacles in reverse. See, this person is trying to save money here, and in reverse, I'm picking up that this person is not able to feel secure or feel the safety the long-term benefit into something right this can be your partner this can be somebody you are in a relationship with or this person is in love with you i do see partnership here right maybe and this person is questioning your decision why are you going away why are you not being here four of swords you're not happy you're not happy I'm, I'm picking up that something is not letting you sleep when you close your eyes this thought just wanders in your mind and you're like i don't know there is something not right for a source i see you very silent and distant right now right you're feeling that this is not my place for someone specific i'm picking up that this is a relationship somebody's in love with you and uh, you just don't feel the way uh, the same maybe you're just not present in the connection 
if this is love i see you feeling that this is not my place this is not my happy place chariot under the deck reversed four of cups flipped over in reverse so i'm picking up here mm, kind of energy where you just need time to think you need time to think and you just you're just distancing yourself from something because you're not able to be present in the situation 100 percent okay let's move forward let's move forward let's have another deck okay taurus sun moon rising venus jupiter There are people or there is a specific person in your surroundings, Taurus, who is trying to question your decision. This person is totally fucked up and confused. Why do you feel so? Okay, moving into your reading, let's clarify further. Ten of Pentacles, Judgment. Hmm, for a lot of you, I'm picking up that... Uh, you want to revive something else in your life. There was a situation that used to make you feel secure and stable. For a lot of you, this is your past connection. This is your commitment. This is your relationship that makes you feel secure. And you just want to be... For someone specific, I'm picking up that if you are in a marriage or if you are in a commitment, you have kids there, you have a family there, or there's something which is... Uh, you know, simply for, for some of you, even if it is not about love or relationships, this can be simply the family thing, right? You feel secure there. You feel that I need to be there. I need to, I just need to be there, right? That makes me feel more secure. And uh, Queen of Pentacles reverse, you feel unstable without this thing. You feel that, you know, if that thing is not present in my life, I feel unstable. Or uncomfortable maybe ace of cups two of pentacles king of pentacles interesting okay hmm. for someone specific taurus i'm picking up that the one you're dealing with is having a choice now this is going to be another storyline so see if it resonates someone specific i'm picking up that you want to work over something which makes you feel stable and happy and you're parting ways from something you're silent in a situation because there is somebody who is maybe the, this is your ex or you had some connection or relationship with this person in the past this person is struggling between two things one is financial security and one is love for someone specific, I'm picking up that you're dealing with somebody. Maybe this person is in love with you, but they're choosing money over you, right? So this is very, very specific. Again, don't force it. Somebody is struggling whether they want love or money, whether they want emotional satisfaction or financial stability. They're struggling in this decision. I don't know why, what, and how this question is coming up on their mind. What are the basis and what is the background i don't know what's the foundation of this struggle but i'm picking up that right you want stability here but somebody is dicey let's see where is the situation heading for taurus page of wands i do see somebody breaking the silence though seven of wands you are fucking not my god your reaction is going to be really big really tough you're going to fight against something here. Somebody's making a decision and you're blocking their decision. Somebody's trying to level up. Hmm. Let's see. Queen of Pentacles. King and Queen of Pentacles. For some of you I'm picking up, it's about... See, for someone specific I'm picking up two things. One is about money matter. For some of you, if it's a relationship, um, there's a marriage already... I'm picking up a very tricky situation here. For some of you, I'm actually picking up that there is a person in your surroundings who is struggling to make a decision whether they want to go for stability in their life, a stable long-term connection, 
or they want to go for some new excitement in their life maybe love or something but this is going to be very specific my god okay queen of swords you want clarity you want clarity whether to wait on to this thing or just move on and you know look for better opportunities and love this is very interesting yet confusing I want to have little more clarity here I do see you might just level up and block this person Taurus because I see this person is struggling between two things for someone specific I heard that if you, if this is your ex-husband or ex-wife right and you want to revive stability in this situation maybe because of kids even if this is a present connection but you know there are sometimes connections where you're just living for kids or the society gender roles queen of wands I do see third party influence here okay what is the Seven of Wands, Queen of Cups, Five of Swords, and Page of Cups? There's something really deceptive. There's manipulation here. Somebody is emotionally manipulating you. What is this decision here? Page, Page of Swords, Moon, and Eight of Cups. Okay, I'm, I'm getting the picture here. Two of Swords under the deck. Just one card for Queen of Pentacles, and then I'm going to a lot of cards. Nine of Swords, Six of Pentacles. Okay, interesting. Wow. So, see, Taurus, I feel that there is somebody who is in love with you, right? But this person either is in a very unhappy marriage or they're stuck in a situation which is materialistic. Now they are dicey whether to opt the love they have for you, the connection they have for you, or they should just be present in something which is materialistic and whatever, right? You are feeling so lost in this situation that this tricky situation is not for me, right? This, this is unhealthy. This is not for me. You are feeling emotional, but somewhere at heart you feel that this situation is turning toxic and manipulative, right? See, if there are mind games, five of swords, you're feeling that it's not for me. Remember, we picked up this same thing in the beginning also. For a lot of you, I see this decision is totally fucking up with your mind. I do feel this person is going to be decisive and for a moment, they might even show you that I'm going to choose, choose you, I'm sorry. But this person is definitely keeping secrets from you, right? They're very upset about something in their life and they're definitely keeping secrets here. For a lot of you, I see walking away out of cups here and see this person is looking at the empty cups. I see you loved them a lot but somehow this person was not able to see your value right and now they're feeling the emotions for you but at the same time they're stuck in a very materialistic situation which they just can't you know deal with six of pentacles six of cups i do see you have the memories and you just sometimes you feel a little anxious about the situation but somehow you're feeling that it's too complicated for for someone specific i'm picking up that whatever the situation is it's too complicated you want stability you want commitment you want partnership you want some long-term promise and if you don't find that in a situation i see you'll be walking away and specifically if you're dealing with somebody who is stuck in a very materialistic situation right so they're struggling to choose between you and this uh, materialistic thing i see wifey energy here and you're feeling that i don't know this is very tricky okay i do see silence for a lot of you i see you just holding silence and you're walking away for introspection for some time right as you might not reply to this person for some time there is a feeling that i don't belong to this place maybe awakening soon wow for a lot of you i see very soon uh, some kind of understanding some kind of epiphany is going to happen here uh, and see there's a new door opening for someone specific i'm picking up that you're leaving a door behind you just getting out of a door here and you're feeling that I don't know what is going to be my new journey, what is what I'm what I will face once I step out of this door. Universe is trying to tell you that a new door is opening for you, right? A new door opening. So very soon there's going to be an awakening that whatever decision you made right now, or whatever decision you're making right now, whatever your decision you made few days ago, 
that was motivated by the universe itself, right? And I think you're going to find something different on this path. Wow, manifest. Yeah, this person is still trying to manifest you. They have emotions for you. They want to open their heart to you. Ace of Cups, they want to express emotionally. But for someone specific, I'm picking up that they're struggling financially and they are in a very materialistic situation right now. It's very hard for them to level up and accept what they feel for you. Right, Taurus? Pay attention to the signs, see? Pay attention to the signs. Where is the situation heading? One card and then we're going to wind up the reading. Wow, freedom, yeah. You need freedom from the situation, mirror self. You're looking at the mirror. You're looking, you're trying to look inside you here, right? And you're understanding that something is not worth your try if somebody's not ready to level up for you, right? Maybe in the near future, this person is going to have some realizations, but... Right now, the important thing is to walk away and introspect and really feel what you want. Pay attention to, to the flag and any, if there's anything which is poking you, you need to claim independence from that situation, right? Whoa, I'll leave you here, Taurus. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Bye.